I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just, I just, oh my God. I just finished watching episode five. So this, this video is going to be a little scrambled. Oh my Christ. Holy Christ. Holy crap. Okay, I have to give I have to give the writers of, of the What If or the uh, Disney, uh, the 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 What If TV show, uh, the the WandaVision TV show, uh, the Loki TV show. No matter how, no matter what stupid you do, you you keep coming up. Whenever I think you can't get any worse, whenever I can't think of, whenever I think. You can't get, you, you, where else can you go? The writers keep coming up with absolutely amazing, creative and unique, wonderful ways of establishing how goddamn stupid they are. I get, oh my God. So, wait, the final scene, the final scene of this episode, okay? <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna, hold on. <laughs> Hold on. <clears throat> the final scene of the episode. So I see Thanos, and I'm going, "What? What, what the hell is Thanos doing here? I, I don't, I don't get it." And then I click in, and I realize, oh, "Okay, he's a zombie." Uh, oh God, that is so sad. Okay, I, I get it. And I'm, and I'm thinking, I'm thinking. That's the stupid. I'm thinking, oh my God, he's a zombie and now they got to deal with Thanos. H how could Thanos have become a zombie? It's stupid. I get it. And I'm thinking, I'm, I'm thinking that's the stupid of Thanos. <laughs> and I see he has. <laughs> oh my God. And he has the Infinity Gauntlet. And I'm going, what, what are you doing? What are you... He's got, he's got the Time Stone. He's got the Power Stone. He's got the Space Zone. The Space Stone. He has the Reality Stone. He's got the Infinity Gauntlet with what? Five of the... The only stone he's missing is the Soul Stone. Okay? He's got five of the Infinity Stones. One of which being the reality stone, and he still became a zombie. He still how 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 goddamn inept and useless of a of a of a of a, of a sentient being do you have to be to be able to have the infinity gauntlet with five of the stones, and you're still that stupid and useless? That you became a zombie? Oh my god. You, you're brilliant. The writers of this show. It's like. There's. The, the, the writers of this show. And every other. And, and WandaVision. And Loki. And the movies. Are going out of their way to establish. They have no goddamn clue what they're doing. I. I. I, I, I really want to watch. I want to watch reaction videos. To this episode because I, I, I got to see the I, I, I have to see the reaction to people when they see Thanos with the infinity gauntlet I, I they, they got to be like okay he's a zombie but but he has the infinity gauntlet like, how, how did he become a zombie with the like there, there's no, please Please, those of you who are brain, those of you who are Marvel zombie fanboys, okay, please, please tell me that when you saw Thanos with the Infinity Gauntlet and five of the Infinity Stones and, and you went, how did he become a zombie? I, I, I don't get, like, I, I just, how? How? I, I get the joke. I get the point. But how? How did, how did the Avengers lose to someone who is so inept that he could have the Infinity Gauntlet with five Infinity Stones and still become... I, I love this show. 
I love this show now, okay? Because it, 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 it's gone off the rails, okay? I get, technically, the MCU has gone off the rails a long time ago, but it's like, this is, this is a train wreck. This is a glorious, hilarious train wreck. It's the Hulk, the Hulk. Okay, now, in this episode, in this episode, with, with what they did with Bruce Banner and the Hulk, okay, invalidated, invalidated what they did to the Hulk in Infinity War and Endgame, okay? Because in, in, in Infinity War and Endgame, they couldn't get, Bruce, Bruce couldn't get the Hulk out, right? Now, as stupid as that was that the Hulk didn't want to come up because he was scared of Thanos, blah, 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 whatever, right? Despite all that, what was even more insulting was that Bruce would, you know, run away like, uh, when uh, the, the two Thanos, when, the, when Thanos' lieutenants hit, uh, followed him to Earth and they were all attacking, you know, Bruce kind of runs and hides or whatever. And I'm going, I go, wait a minute, wait, whoa, 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 time out, time out. In the first Avengers movie, right, when, you're, when Bruce is talking to uh, Black Widow, and she goes, if you're gonna try and shoot me, that's not gonna work out too well because I tried to shoot myself and the other guy stopped me. Uh, in Thor Ragnarok, right, when Bruce uh, jumped, off the, jumped onto the bridge with the mentality that he was gonna become the Hulk and the Hulk was gonna save him, that's what happened. So the movies have already established, okay, that the Hulk will save Bruce Banner's life. So whenever, when I saw I, I, I'm, I'm sure I'm not the only one. I'm sure I'm not the only one. But there's a bunch of us who are obviously when we saw Bruce and he couldn't turn into the Hulk, our suggestion was just just run towards the big the big guy. Just run towards the big guy. As soon as he tries to hit you, you're going to turn into the Hulk because the Hulk is going to come out. <coughs> Excuse me. You're going to force the Hulk to come out. And then we we would have the Hulk. When uh, in, in Endgame, when they're at uh, Wakanda, Ban Banner was in the in the Hulkbuster suit. Why? When uh, when T'Challa, uh, I mean I mean when King T'Challa, right, uh, said open up the the dome, and all those creatures came through. All Bruce would have had to do was just you know casually walk towards them. Once any of them tried to attack him, he would have forced the Hulk out. But, and because the movie purposely went out of its way to not have Bruce do that, we all knew, okay, that it was a bullshit thing to, for them to do. Then this episode of, of What If comes out and literally establishes, yeah, yeah, we could have easily have had Bruce Banner walk up to the, the zombies and it, that'll force the Hulk to come out. Well, why didn't you have Bruce do that in the goddamn Infinity War and Endgame movies, you fucking assholes? You, you, you literally showed a scene. Like, you could have at least pleaded ignorance that you didn't think it up, that you didn't know that that would have been a possibility. But then in this episode, you pretty much established, yeah, yeah, that's exactly what would have happened. So now you don't even have any, you, you can't even plead ignorance in not having had the Hulk in Infinity War and Endgame, you idiots. You idiots. Yes, I liked the Hulk, and I wanted the Hulk in Infinity War, and I wanted the Hulk in the Endgame movies too, okay? I, I, I know, I, 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 cause, you know, I did, I did notice him in one of the trailers, right? But, like, this episode is just ridiculous. Like, what? Okay, first of all, okay? Why would Wanda need a, the Vision? Okay, wants to feed Wanda. Uh, what well, Wanda? I, I think Wanda can feed herself. I think Wanda can feed herself. Not only that, what what's going to happen when you run out of humans? If the entire Earth suddenly becomes zombies, I I it just what. I, Oh, and no, not, not only that, not only that. So the Hulk, uh, Bruce, in the beginning of the episode, right? Bruce comes down and you got the, the, the I forget which creatures there were, right? And then uh, it was uh, 
the, the lieutenants, right? The Thanos' lieutenants, right? And then you have zombie Doctor Strange, zombie uh, Iron Man, take them out in like five seconds. In five, in five seconds, they're just totally boom, 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 boom. Power attack, knock them out down. Hey, morons, morons. What you just did in this episode was establish how useless they were fighting in the Infinity War movie. You, you, zombie, zombie, a, a zombie Tony Stark and a zombie Doctor Strange are better tacticians, better fighters, better, more competent than the non-zombie version of them. This is... This is hilarious. I couldn't stop laughing. I could not stop laughing at this episode. It was hilarious. Okay, the only, uh, uh, Scott Lang. I was actually laughing with Scott Lang because his jokes were funny. His jokes were funny. Everybody else's jokes were ridiculous. Like the blam, 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 that was stupid with Happy. And then that stupid shirt he was wearing, whatever. That, that, like that was typical uh, Marvel uh, humor. Whereas, I, I, like did they hire did they hire a professional comedy writer to write Scott Lang's lines because those were the only ones that were funny. But uh, I, I, like it was just oh my god, and it was like the tone, the tone kept switching. Is it am I, is it supposed to be a horrorish, or is it supposed to be a comedy? Uh, again, I understand it's geared to the kids, so they can't be too horror based, but. Like you, you would get like, you know, two minutes of horror, and then it was like shifting it to comedy, and it was like, I, hello, whiplash the entire episode. Uh, yeah, uh, and, 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 the, and it's like, like, like Thor. You had like the Avengers got became zombies so easily. It was just. just uh, this is just hilarious. I, I, everything else compare. I, I'm sorry. Everything else in this episode, okay, pales in comparison to Thanos with the Infinity Gauntlet and still became a zombie. That, oh, that, that's just brilliant. That was, I, 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 I am jealous of the creative skill these writers have to come up with such absolute stupid and I, I, please please tell me some of you at least some of you saw Thanos with the infinity gauntlet still being a zombie and went okay now now uh, Disney and the MCU even that you can't accept. Even that bullshit stupid. You have to go, okay, even I, even you can't handle, even you can't swallow that bullshit. T tell me, some of you. I, I, oh, this is, oh. I, oh, is there anything else? Uh, like, like. Again, I, I, I can't really trust the comedy aspects of this episode because it's comedy. It, it, it's, it's supposed to be ridiculous. It's supposed to be irreverent. But it was like, just... This, this was... I, I, I have to keep watching now because I need to... I, I, I don't know how they're going to top... I don't know how they're going to top Thanos with the infinity gauntlet and still being a zombie. I don't know how they're going to how, how they're going to top it. But I, I I have to watch. I have to keep watching because I have to find out. I have to see what what new creative bullshit stupid the the, uh, the writers of this show are going to come up with this. Oh man, this I I, I wasn't even and here's the weird thing. I had I wasn't even gonna watch the whole episode. I wasn't even gonna watch the whole episode because I, after I had seen the the Doctor Strange episode, right, and which was you know 
I'm sorry, it was very weak, it was very lame. There was really nothing, to, it was just stupid, it was just lame. It was, I, I, I'm thinking, are they already, have they already, you know, run out of ideas? And then I see episode five, and it's like, oh, it's the zombies. And then I'm looking at the zombies, and I'm watching the first, I watched like the first 10 minutes, and I'm going, okay, so apparently they've already run out of ideas, okay? Like f four episodes in, and they've already run out of ideas. So I didn't even originally, okay, even see the whole episode because I, I decided to just give up on it. I, I, I literally had given up on the what if episode because I'm going, Dr. Strange creates a, a, an evil version of himself to save whatever that girlfriend's name was. And then episode five is a zombie episode, yay. But uh, somebody wanted me to actually review uh, the, the episode, so I ended up sticking through uh, the entire episode of episode five, and oh my god, was it hilarious! I, I shoot the head like, how hard can it be for superheroes? Like, literally, you could have had Wasp, okay, just do nothing but stay in the air and just fire at all the zombies' heads, and they would have all died. Because the, the, the episode actually says, aim for the head, and that'll kill them. So, it, it just, it just, just, just get, like, uh, oh, whatever, I think it was, uh, I, I can't remember the uh, Wakandan uh, bodyguard, Oyana, I can't remember her name, I can't, re I can't remember, I think it was Oyana, I probably got that wrong. You got, you got a Wakandan uh, a vibranium staff, just keep firing energy bolts, I, I, just, I, Bucky! Bucky, go to an armory. Like, did anybody not see Resident Evil 2? Okay, just stand on a, a rooftop with a sniper rifle and just ping everybody off. Like, the, you're superheroes. You're superheroes. You're gonna get taken down by. Like, how do you get taken down by human zombies? You're superheroes. You goddamn morons. Wear a suit of armor and just walk. Stay in the air. Stay in the air and just... Uh, uh, the, the level of stupid that is necessary to, 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 to actually make any of these dumbass stories work is just hilarious. I loved it. I loved it. Kudos. Kudos to the writers. You come up with just absolutely beautiful ways uh, uh, of making me laugh at how stupid you are. And, and, and to think, and, and, and guarantee... Guaranteed, there are Marvel zombie, there are just as many brain dead Marvel zombie fanboys who, after watching this, went, like, Oh my god, that was the night great episode. Oh my god, did you see? Oh my god, Thanos is a zombie. What are they gonna do now? It, I, I don't know how they're gonna top this. I think I'm gonna call it now. Episode five is going to be the pinnacle. Of, of, of the stupid uh, of the of this show because I don't know how they're gonna beat it. I don't know how they're gonna beat it. Uh, anyway, uh, this 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 video's gone way too long. Uh, I'm out of here. Uh, I gotta go do uh, episode uh, for the doctor the Doctor Strange one, but whatever. Anyway, I'm out of here. See ya.